hello hello everyone welcome back to my channel it's your girl queenie urbane and i am just bored right now so i'm like let me make a video um i did recently purchase some stuff as well as received a package from Setbird. so i said let me do a video i just got in from a night out i should probably get me a glass of wine but i got work tomorrow so i don't know if i want to be a little tipsy at work but um yeah i just bought this package from Scentbird. i um got this package from Scentbird. um i am subscribed to Scentbird. i got the two um perfumes um subscription um so this wasn't sent to me for like free as a sponsorship though if you want to sponsor your girl hit her up because i'm always down to collab so I just wanted to show my channel. Um, this is what I got from Scentberg. So the fragrance, your fragrance this month is Grace de Monaco. Ooh. Um, Promenade Sur Le Rocher. Promenade Sur Le Rocher is a bold and passionate fragrance inspired by American icon Grace Kelly. While capturing the essence of the modern French Riviera, Riviera, a pure celebration with radiant floral top notes that evolve elegantly on skin to become a more sensual fragrance with a touch of warmth. So it is like a rose, a bergamot, jasmine, amber, and wood. So that's pretty hot. Um, and then, I'm, oh, that's interesting. One came with this, but one didn't. So I wonder which one is which. This is, oh, it's a travel spray. Oh, that's so cool. How does this work? Do I pull it out? Or does it spray from here? Oh, no, this, uh, I guess this is the travel one. And it shows how to refill on the bottles. So that's pretty cool. And the next one is called deck of scarlet that's what this month's fragrance is um and the brand name is scarlet and it says imagine the color red bottled the color of passion love energy fire precious gemstones Ooh, i'm about to wear this one right now honestly but says gemstones represented in the dynamic blend italian lemon black carrot black carrot grapefruit open big and bold as lush dec decadent rose take center stage delicate phony oh my god delicate phony mingles with suede musk sandalwood and jaik jaik wood kicking the sensuality up a notch okay it started to become like a real tongue twister but this sounds like so sexy like i'm gonna wear it now oh and i'm gonna show you guys um someone got me some flowers let me show you guys Aren't they so gorgeous? So gorgeous. Cards. Um, I have this card and it says, Hello, beautiful. We are thrilled to welcome you to the magic of Scentbird. Your monthly perfume fix has arrived. That sounds so lovely. Um, and oh, I can't wait to get new perfumes every month. Literally, I just started buying more perfumes. Like I showed you guys my staple five collection from before, from like my in like the childhood origins of like why I got those specific scents. But now I'm like, all right, and a child has been fulfilled. Now it's time for grown woman Queenie to step in, and we're gonna start getting our fragrance collection up. If it's up, then it's stuck. Period. Okay, so how to use? Twist the spray, twist the clothes, just like lipstick. Oh, okay, cool. So. Oh, wait, okay, let's not start with this one. Let's start with this one because it looks a little more simpler. So it says twist, okay, so twisted it open. Okay, cool, cool. And it says um, how to use, and then twist, pull the old vial up to remove, drop in the new scent, twist. Oh, rate your scent, go to your profile to rate your perfume. The more you rate, the better your recommendations become. Okay, update your 
catch changer case. I don't know which one this is. There's no label on it on everything, anything, but I'm gonna just smell it and based off the scent, guess which one of these two it is. <clears throat> this one's not. <clears throat> I actually like the smell, but it's very musky. Not musky, but like this is very, a very mature scent. It's, no, no, it's like mature, but still playful, but like definitely more on the mature side. I don't know. This sounds like the Scarlet smell, honestly. Because this, the, the, the way this is described, this sounds like a, it's supposed to be a little more, um, this just sounds like something more dark and mysterious, honestly. A very mysterious scent. Like if like someone passed me, I'd be like, I imagine somebody in like a dark, glimmer, shimmery light restaurant or hookah lounge. Not hookah lounge, but like classy night time bar. You know, like almost like a a a, a, a classy strip club. Almost like someone walking by with this scent. <laughs> Low key. That's what that's making me think of. Oh, and then the travel one, you open like this. Oh, oh, I was right. Because this one, when you open it, is the, um, it's this one. You probably can't see. So that means I was right. Ah, look at me. Look at me. Okay, so I'm going to spray this one. Oh, this one is so, oh, this is a good perfume. Like, I only sprayed once in this, like, booming at my nose. God, I love that. Okay, let's try this one. Ooh! Grace de Monaco? Promenade sur la Rochelle? <laughs> I'm gonna have to get into that. Oh my God, this smells so good. I put this on, I'm gonna be a problem for somebody. Like, this is like, this is such a sultry, but like, Fresh smell, oh my god, like, this is how I want to smell. This like almost like a cologne almost, like, but like a, a feminine cologne. Oh, it's just such a good scent. I don't know how to describe it, but you guys, they, I, you know, they make you take a quiz on like your scent, and literally the like results I got from the quiz I took, like your favorite type of scents, was like, you are sexy, feminist, and mysterious. Like, <laughs> And that's what these smell like, so <laughs> get into it. Um, next, I bought this book from my godmother, Shira Seven. <laughs> um, I really wanted to just buy her book, so I was like, let me buy her book and like really see. Honestly, I'll be honest, you guys, I did not expect it to be this thin. Like, this is the thinnest book I've ever bought in my life. Um, this is like a magazine, a little bit, but I am so excited to read it. And I mean, quick read, straight to the point. Like, her videos sometimes, sometimes they be hours long, but. <laughs> I bought her book and I'm gonna read it and I'll do a review, guys, if you guys want, because you know I'm on a level up. Ashira, she's queen of level up. So I'm gonna read this book and then let you guys know how I feel about it. But that's one of the things I also recently purchased. Great. Okay, so next I want to show you guys my favorite lip combo I've been wearing lately. So right now, do you guys see my lips? They look so good i've been doing my makeup and following a makeup tutorial of like this girl right here um if i'm like not too lazy to edit this video um there's gonna be a video of the makeup tutorial i've been following like pretty much every day like sitting in front of my new vanity and just like practicing my makeup they said marilyn monroe like what she used to do was like sit in front of the mirror and study her face like you can tell she really knew how to accentuate her makeup to where it really made her structure and everything about her glow. Like some people never really sit sit and spend the time to know what really works for them. And I feel like I'm finally in that stage of my life where stuff like that matters. So like even earlier today, um, I was mixing my foundations and I was like, okay, I have to come up with a ratio because I finally have foundation that matches my skin, right? Um, like I've been using foundation, I guess that hasn't been matching for a long time, I didn't know that, right? So I really just sat down, I bought, like I really just invested because you guys, 
me and like spending money sometimes, especially on like makeup items. I do it, but it's just not as often as I should. But I really just like, let me invest in myself. And I bought like a bunch of like brown L'Oreal foundations, just drugstore. And I just was like mixing up the colors and I finally got like my actual shade, I think. Um, and you know, maybe I do need to, and I don't even know, you know, it looks like my shade and I've just been looking so much better really practicing my makeup and stuff. So long story short, I'm, I got this like new lip combo that's like totally my thing. Um, and it's a brown lip liner all around, right? And then I put on this lipstick, which um, is just from Wet n Wild, right? It's such a good lipstick. And like this is what produces the like Barbie pink kind of like undertone to it. But trust me, we're not going to just wear this because that's like kind of ratchet. But look, so it produces this like cute little Barbie pink, right? This is Wet n Wild. Um, ooh, this perfume. Ooh. Dip, 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 when you slide in, ooh. That's like me, every time I like smell my wrist right now. Um, the color is called Mwaba Out of Hair. Mwaba Out of Hair or something, right? And then after that, I put on this lip gloss from Wet n Wild called Cloud Pout, because I went to Target the other day and just bought like a bunch of lip glosses and stuff. So this one is from Wet n Wild and it's called uh, Marshmallow Lip Mousse. So I would put that on on top and that's what kind of adds the like nudish color now. So like we got the transition of like the brown from the hot pink to the um, nude. And then this is the finisher right here. Absolutely New York Freshly Bitten Gloss right here. I don't, I don't even remember where I got this from, but like this one is like what makes it really, really glossy. And that has been like my whole shebang. Like, that has been my lip. And I've been like feeling myself. And then this thing, you guys, you guys have to buy this. It's called a makeup brush cleansing spray. And literally, this one, you literally just spray a napkin and you wipe your makeup brush on it and it cleans your makeup brush. Like, no soap, no water, instant dry, everything. Like, this has been changing the game for me. I mean, I already wash my makeup brushes, but I only do that, um, like, about, like, twice a week. So I feel like doing this would really help me to um, clean it more often and probably will help my skin because, you guys, I'm really on a journey with my skin. I'm trying to get it clear. I want to get a chemical peel soon. Um, I'm just trying to figure out when will I be okay with looking like that for a little while. You know, like, the chemical peel really, like, peels your face. Um, and next, I got this... Well, lastly, I got this Wet n Wild, and I got this like brush on my bed. But lastly, I got this Wet n Wild Photo um, Photo Focus Face Primer, matte, um, matte, matte. Like I'm so obsessed with this. Like my foundation literally looks so smooth right now, and it's because of this primer. And um, I just grabbed it because it was cheaper than the one I originally grabbed, which I think was Maybelline. <laughs> So, oh no no I, I grabbed the NYX one originally and then I was like wait this went wild is a little cheaper so I grabbed it and I really love how my makeup looks I really love how my makeup is turning out lately um and I've just been watching that YouTube video every day every time well not every day but every time I do my makeup like I'm where I am in my life right now is like I'm literally acting like a student again to everything because I've learned all this stuff already but Clearly, I forgot or something. So, <laughs> I think it's time for me to just relearn everything. Or not just learn it. You know, like, I, as a kid, I would just watch stuff. But now, I really, like, am practicing everything that I was learning before. And it's really awesome watching, like, everything come to fruition. Because I do feel like my most inner, baddest self right now. Oh, my God. Let me show you guys one other thing. Let me show you one, guys one last thing. They hide all my information. But on Amazon, they're selling AirPod cases that look like little, well, that literally is like the Coach logo. Like, I don't even know if that's like right or like allowed, but it's like so cute. Like, my AirPods is like Coach. <laughs> Hot, okay. That was today's video. I just showed you guys random stuff that I got recently. Make sure to use my link below if you're gonna purchase anything from Simper. Just as a referral, you know, might as well use my link if you're gonna sign up 
for the website. Um, thank you guys all so much for watching. Thumbs up this video. And let me know if you guys want me to make more like random videos just like talking about stuff. <laughs> I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.